Hi guys, this is Amr from Certified Powers. Today I'll be showing you how to load a permissions file into a Freedom 2. For this process, we will need a USB flash drive and a computer with USB capability. It is also recommended to use a USB flash drive from the vendors listed on the screen. The first thing I want to do is to show you how to check the current permission on the Freedom 2 spreader. Turn on your device by pressing this lane knob. It will take you straight to the home screen, which should look something similar to this. Press and hold the mode slash menu button for about two seconds. This will take you to the main menu. From there, tap on System Setup. Next, tap on System Info. On this screen, you will be able to see all sorts of information about your Freedom 2 spreader. We want to look at where it says Permission Level. It will either say 2.0, 2.1, or 2.2. For this demonstration, mine says 2.0. For the rest of this video, I will show you how to get the new files onto the USB stick then, how to load them into the Freedom 2 device. But before we do that, I will show you how to check if your flash drive is in the correct format. And if it isn't, I'll show you how to apply the correct settings. When you plug your flash drive into a USB port on your computer, it should pop up on your file explorer. Right click the flash drive and find where it says Format. Click that. A small properties window should appear. Under the File System drop-down menu, make sure that FAT or FAT32 is selected. If not, select FAT and hit Start. If it is, you can go ahead and hit Close. Formatting USB flash drive will delete all existing files. Make sure the USB flash drive being used is empty. Download the attachment received from Certified Power. The files will be in a compressed or zip folder. For this demo, I will be loading a 2.2 file into the spreader. You can follow these steps for loading a 2.0 and a 2.1 as well. The first thing we want to do is to right click this folder. Go ahead and click Extract All on the menu. Next, click on Browse. Select your USB flash drive from the list. Then click Select Folder. Click on Extract. The files will now be found on your USB flash drive. All these .bin files are not meant to be accessed on a computer. The Excel file will contain a text version of the configuration settings. You may now eject and remove the USB stick from the computer. This device has two USB ports. Insert your USB stick into the port closest to the screen. Restart your Freedom 2 device by pressing and holding the lane knob. Let go when you see this alert message. Then, press the same knob again to start your device backup. In order to load our files, we need to give the device administrative access. Back on the home screen, Access the main menu by holding the mode slash menu button for about two seconds. Tap on user level. Select admin from the user drop down menu. The password will also typically be admin in lowercase. Select System Setup. 
Then scroll down until you see Save and Restore. And tap that. Now in this menu, select Permissions. Make sure not to tap Restore Factory Default, Firmware or Configuration. You want to only select Permissions. Select Restore. A confirmation message will pop up. Tap Yes. Press the mode slash menu button. Your device should restart automatically. Now if we follow the same steps that we took to check the current version by holding the mode slash menu button, then accessing system setup, then system info, you will see that now where it says permission level, it will show 2.2. This confirms that our permission file was loaded successfully. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to give us a call on the number provided on the screen or visit our website at www.certifiedpowersolutions.com.